That was a good try. You guys ever watched the movie Last of the Airbenders? They're trying to, everybody working together, that, you know? I see a person up there on the third floor earlier, man. They were reading a book, man. Like, man, what did that person do reading a book, man? They sent the guy over, you know, it's like, what are you doing in there? It's like, it's like, oh, I don't know. So I got to tell you about this, man. God is going to tell you with the wind what's been going on. Now, I wasn't there. It's like stardust, man. But I'm going to tell you what happens. I got me a trash cannon over there, man. You see? And then I got me a satellite dish. I'm trying to correct the... Can you learn some stuff with some... You know, we put it on TV, you know, can you watch it and learn some morals and ethics? And then with that, I could take that and mold your mind and just help you with the physics, man. And it's fix the atmosphere, you know, because it, it, it expand a vacuum and you got to put something in there, man. It's, we're hungry. The air is hungry, you know, the people's hungry. The air is hungry. The trees are hungry. You know what else is hungry? Those trash bins, man. Put the trash in the trash bins, not on the side of the road. And by God, try to recycle. So here we go. Now the wind's coming this way. Now earlier, you know, with my aircraft carrier, man. Here goes some aliens over there right now, man. They're like doing telepathy right now, like telepathic stuff. It's like, hey, can you tell them about that stuff, man? I was like, what stuff? He said, you know, I'm walking down a sidewalk and you know there's trash everywhere, man. I'm like, I can't believe it, man. Can you tell them not to throw the trash on the sidewalk? You know, we got visitors and stuff, man. Not just from other states, you know, from other planets, you know? <sighs> Come down here to try to fix stuff. I'm like, man, what are they doing? They're throwing trash on the sidewalk, man. We're trying to fix the planet. So I'll tell you what. Must have been a gap between the trees. They were trying to, you know, get the wavelength off. They said maybe we'll get a little relief to go through the trees, you know. And then when it cool off, the air will come through here and go through there and replenish. It says, no, man, there's a building in the way. A building's in the way. Yeah, a man, a building's in the way. So now we've got resistance to slow the air down at night when it's cold and it's more thick. And it says, and it was too much. Maybe it'll go through there. It says, no, you missed, man. Why? Because it bounced off, man, the side of the building. And then you got water over there, man. It's a little thick. Bounced off that, sent it this way. But it had a forward motion, man, because it's trying to bounce back to where all that. You remember pulling all the heavy air? Heavy air, heavy air, and then we throw it earlier, right? Now we gotta fill it back up. And winds, you know, just like the trees. Got a gap there, man. Oh, totally missed it. So now we got a heat wave coming through there. Heat wave. Now we got a heat wave. You know, what do you got a heat wave? A little bit of heat, man. Just, you know, and then it's like trying to. So the heat wave's coming, but it's not enough because it's bouncing off of that, right? It's not enough to make it go through that hole. Okay, like a scope, man. We're trying to aim, right? And like, no, man. You bounce off there. You got this water coming up, okay? And now it's trying to fill back up over there. And now you got, up. Oh, the wind just stopped. See, the wind just stopped. And now it's like a pulse, and now it's stopped, now it pick up. It's like being on a sailboat in the middle of the night waiting on wind saying, please, give me a little bit of wind, you know? No, I didn't get it quite right, man. A little off course. Okay, hold on. Okay, now I got wind. Okay, no. Okay, shh. Now I got wind. Like a one crazy summer, man. They're out there on a the sailboat telling around, man, done on a motor, man. You know? So this is okay. Now the wind's coming down, man. It says, shh. Why? Well, I'll tell you why. This is the ecological system. This is how the ecological system works. The ecological system is very intricate. Intricate? 
Well, intelligent nations, try care. Eight, educational, you know, education and training. Did you eat? Eight. Can you figure eight out? Intricate, intelligent nations. Okay, try to triangulate and try care. Intricate American telepathic education, alien telepathic education, angel telepathic education. Eight for infinity and beyond. The space force system can teach you. There you go. That's how you explain it. And you say, you got a trees here. They evaporate when the sun is out. Shh, shh. Not the sun. The men are here to save people, build stuff, and do cool things, man. The sun shine. When the sun shine is out. And then the son looks at the son and says, Son, I'm trying to tell these people how this works for the Egyptians and everybody else around the world. Anti-gravity. Tractor beam from the sun. From the sunshine in the sky. Like a reverse helicopter. If it gets too crazy, you get a tornado. And then really start pushing it up even faster. Oh man, we gotta push it up real quick because if it gets too big, we get a big hurricane. Okay, get it up there, man. No problem. But we got the trees, man, with the leaves and stuff. Don't take too much. Okay, we got leaves. Let's just take it off the top, man. Just off the forest top. The rainforest top? Yeah, man, the rainforest top. That's why we saved the rainforest. A lot of rain comes down. It gets down in the ground, and it's all wet and nice and, you know, dry. But uh, they keep it real humid, man, and just the leaves. They keep it from all escaping and slow it down, man. Slow down the compression. It says, all right, just take a little bit. Just take a little bit. Just take a little bit. Okay. So they warm the treetops up, man. What are we going to do now, man? Call Motown. We need those guys singing Motown, man. Why? Because they, they went to town to learn some education because when they came from, the places they came from was nothing but dirt. There's nothing uh, hungry, man. They mowed it all down with storms and fires and wars and greed and eat, 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 never putting anything back. They said, man, can you get over there and sing us some music like Motown while you're getting this education, okay? Say, Mo, give me Mo education. Motown has mo resources. We got a Motown music, okay? You wonder why all those black Americans are famous? Man, they're singing Motown music, man. I'm going to town on this education. I'm reading these books, man. I'm going to listen to this guy. This is Motown music for mo education, for mo food, for mo education, for mo resources. Motown, you get what I'm saying? I go, there you go, man. You go, hey, look over here, man. We don't want that, man. We want, whoo, okay, and then the sun goes down, the air is cooling, and here comes the heavier air, man. Why? Because just like the trees are hungry for water, and every now and I get too hot, it says, man, God says, give me some rain. Man, is that a tomato? Oh, thank you, God. The gift of diplomacy. Whew. So the trees, man, taking the water back. Give me the water. 
you know, Kevin Costner, man, he's on Waterworld, man. He's like, hey, we got to find some land with some trees. Why? Because, man, we left the deserts. We went out in the ocean and we're trying to find some land that's got some trees. It's so hot in there, man. You know, we had to make like nuclear suits just to walk through it, man, to cover it up, man. Because, you know, you go out there, your skin might bubble off, you know, because the, the nuclear radiation from fallout, man, and just, God, got to get out of here, man, you know. So the water come down, man. <sighs> Raining on the forest. <sighs> we got a little gap over there, man. The theory is sound. Somebody tried to do their own little math here. It's kind of funny. But, you know, success is not to try and fail, but to fail to try. So they put a bunch of dirt, they're weighing this down. Put a bunch of dirt, they're weighing this down. Maybe the wind will come over here and just, the dirt, just do a couple of trees, a little gap, you know, just do a little feathering, man. You know, you know, but the problem is the air is cold, it's coming down. The trees are soaking it up and it fill that up with pressurized air, right? Because there's no tree there to slow it down. So the pressurized air comes down and fills that gap, right? And then you got this stuff, right? Now, if you had a better mechanism, because it didn't bounce off of that and land over here and go that way, and plus you just filled that with pressurized air, so now it's just flowing out. That's like a piece of the invisible wall now it just flows right on by now if you had a smaller structure with some heat you know heating up all day and then you know in New York City they used to get these real bad heat waves man I mean like heat waves well that was from you know other things and other devices you know that I'm not disclosed here as top secret stuff but uh, you had heat waves trying to get the water to jump over but they were missing with their calculations because their equipment was uh, over or under engineered and you know they had to make some corrections. Well then people started fighting and uh, arguing you know and things got out of hand so then we had courtesy officers and a department of corrections to slow everybody down and just calm down, calm down, while we try to educate everybody all at the same time. Those big corporations, you know, they've been there for a while, you know. They're trying to disperse this here and that there and get this program going and that program and they get everybody in the same room. Nobody's really working together and they're all arguing and shooting each other and it's just stupid, man. You got water, you got trees, you got food. You get together, you make a design, everybody make a money, and then, you know, you start, I mean, you, you take the lightweight trees, man, and put them on the newly designed aircraft and start shipping them over into these greenhouses, man. That's all for today.